Greetings, true believers. This is JR369. Welcome back for another figure review. Today, I'll be taking a look at the Marvel Legends, Marvel Studios, the first 10 years, Thor, the Dark World 2-pack that features Thor and Lady Sif by Hasbro. Now, take a look at the, the packaging here. The box here is unlike the the MCU first 20, first 10 years. You get the Marvel Studios, the first 10 years logo right here. You can see the Legends series there. Right there you can see Thor's hammer. And those have the names. Thor and Sif, not Lady Sif. Hasbro logo here. Warning choking Hasbro. And it's recommended for ages 4 plus. And you get the Thor the Dark World logo right here. On the side here. There's like a small read up about the, uh, come on. About the character, if you want to, about the, the movie, if you want to read it, go ahead, pause the video. And on the other side, it uh, shows, like, concept artworks. Like, you might collect all the figures from the MCU Marvel Legends Wave and you build, like, a full poster. And on the back here, you got the little image poster of Thor The Dark World. And there's a read-up bio about both characters. Let's start off with Sif. It says, A long-time ally of Thor and a powerful Asgardian warrior, Sif battles with a double-bladed sword and keen understanding her of her enemies. Whew. Now let's take a look at Thor's bio. It says, Side-by-side -side with his child childhood friend, Sif Thor strikes down the moderns on Van Han Vanani, I don't know how you pronounce that word. Seeking to bring peace back to the Nine Realms. So that's about it for the packaging. Now let's release Thor and Sith out of the box. Here we got Thor and Sith out of their pack box. Now let's start off with Sith first. Now take a look at the figure itself. Now the likeness to the actress who plays Sith. I gotta say, they did a really nice job capturing the likeness to her. The 3D printing on her looks really a dead on to the actress who played her. The hairstyle looks perfect. On this figure, looks really decent as well. Now, the whole outfit here. Now, the outfit here, I gotta say, it has like a little bit like a little shininess to it. You get the, the pad, the armor pads, arm pads there. You get like the little, you get a little thing there, you know, the medieval type. You get the gauntlets on her hand, her arm, her arms. You get the armory ar around her body. You get the little medieval or Asgardian type of boots there, with the little thing there as well. You get the like little screws there. On the back, nothing much. It's more armor there. And you can see there's like the little straps where her her pads are, her arm pads are. There's supposed to like the straps to hold on her arms. The boots, nothing much on the boots here. Just plain old black. And on the bottom, there's some pickles in the bottom of the feet. And no legal, legal those, uh, I don't know where. Is in her, yep, in her legs. Uh, well, it does hide out the legal stuff. So that's about it for Lady Sif here. Now let's look at Thor, the God of Thunder. Take a look at the head scope here. Now the head likeness to Prince Hemsworth. I gotta say, did a really nice job catching the likeness to him. Now take a look at the outfit here. The outfit... They did a really nice job with the outfit. Everything it's on the figure looks perfect. Not too bad at all. Not too bad. Very similar to the Thor, to the Thor, the second Thor film figure. You get the little loin cloth there. Here you get the little gold ridges there, gold gauntlets as well. You get the little boots there as well. And take a look at the cape here. The cape 
looks really nice. You get the little wrinkles sculpting onto it on the inside. You can see like the little fur there on the inside. Very nice. Only one problem is you can see the little tear right here. Yeah. That yeah. When you if you want to take out the figure, you might be careful taking out the cape here because of the the ridges there. Man. And also you can see the little ponytail sculpting on his hair. And on the bottom there's some legal stuff and peggles in the bottom feet as well. Overall the figure itself is not too bad. Not too bad at all. For our articulation, let's look at Sith here. It's the articulation, the articulation on the head scope here is very limited because of the hair, but does go down this low, does go up this high. Again, the hair is limitation. The arms go full rotate, does go in and out, but it's hindered by the armor pad. Pin at the does have the pen at the elbows, rotate at the elbows. The wrist can rotate and does have the hinge move. Mint. There's like the upper chest rotation that has a little ball joint. Legs can kick forward and back, in and out, upper leg rotation. There we go. Been at two points at the knee. They can kick at her own behind. And ankles can go pivot forward back and ankle pivot side to side, which is a Weird direct, weird direction, to be honest. Articulation-wise, it's a basic Marvel Legends style articulation, but you can make great posability with this figure. And for Thor here, uh, stay, stay. Uh, there we go. Oh, oh, stay, stay. Come on. Yeah, she won't stand up. Oh, there we go. There we go. And for Thor, she, he does have the rotation of the head here. Well, not really because of the center by the cape and the hair. He does have the little ball joint on him here. Arms go... Doesn't go fully rotate because it's hindered by this here. And does go in and out. Bend at two points at the elbows. Rotate it. At the wrist and does have the hinge movement here. There's the ab rotation on the ball joint there. Legs and kick forward and back in and out. Upper leg rotation. Been at two points at the knee. And again, unlike Sips, he can kick his own behind. And ankles can go pivot forward and back. And ankle pivot side to side. Ooh yeah. Again, just a basic Marvel Legends articulation, but you can still make great posability with this figure. For accessory-wise, Sith comes with several accessories. She does come with the double-bladed sword, which you can easily detach. Uh, nothing much I can explain about this. And also does come with the single go sword. Which I'm pretty sure is exactly the same, but no, but the blade is smaller, probably different. And finally, she does come with a shield, with the straps on there. Now let's put the figure with her accessories. Do do do, do do do. So let me grab the. The sword here. There we go. Now the other one. Oh, come on.
And there you go, you got Sith ready to battle. Fight Malekith. Now let's put her aside there. There we go. And of course, with Thor, he does come with his me owner. With a little with a little the rope here there so he can like spin it. Now let's put on his hand here off camera. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Come on. There we go. Now you got Thor ready to battle along with Sith here. Lady Sif. Overall for this two pack, it's not too bad at all. I actually do like the to like I did like this two pack so much. I mean that I mean I'm really glad they added the a new character. Well this Thor here, we got like several MCU Thors, but I don't have any MCU Thors, so this is actually my first MCU Thor here. Both of these figures do look really great. The articulation is just Marvel Legends, but you can make great posability with this figure. The accessories are great. The whole outfit here looks perfect. Everything, the likenesses to the actors looks great. And I'm really happy I have this this two pack in my collection. Since I got one, I got this pack on eBay for twenty bucks, and then later on it was on sale at Walmart online. And then it was 14 bucks, and I'm kind of regretted it purchasing one from eBay. Eh, what, what do I expect? I get what I get. For my rate, I'm going to get the Marvel Legends, Marvel Studios' first 10 years, two pack of Thor and Lady Sif, uh, of a rate of 9.5 out of 10. So that's about it. Make sure to, to tune in for new videos daily. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share this video, and comment on this video. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon so you can be notified of new videos after you subscribe so you won't miss any new uploads. And you can be part of the notification squad. And finally, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both links will be in the description down below. So that's all I can say. This is the Marvel Legends, Marvel Studios, the first 10 years. Thor The Dark World 2-Pack that features Thor and Lady Sif figures by Hasbro. And this is JR369. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next review.